Hey friends, Tux here. For this particular video, I just got a brand new Your Toy Box. Of course, this is the monthly subscription service where you fill out a little survey and then they go ahead and send you a box of toys every month customized just for you. And I think that's excellent. People ask me sometimes, they're like, oh, hey Tux, why do you do those subscription boxes? I really love getting mail. I love giving gifts. I love receiving gifts. And this is just fun because you just don't know what it is. Like sometimes I can guess what gifts are and I'm not the best at guessing, but it's really fun just to have a random box of stuff sent to me. So I have no idea. This could be great. This could be terrible. It could be anything. I bet I predict there's probably some Pokemon in here. There might be a video game maybe you know like there's gonna be some fun stuff in here and I gotta tell you like I just I really really enjoy this stuff and I'm being totally sincere about that so I'm excited I hope you guys are excited and we're gonna find out what's in this your toy box right now got my little knife here we'll go ahead and cut this bad boy open I feel like it's been a while since I got my last one and I know they're on schedule and everything. It just, I really enjoy this so much that when I um, get done with it, I almost wish there was like another one coming sooner, but it is a monthly thing for me. So, all right, let's see what we have. I go ahead and open this up and pull out any kind of packing. It's usually a little like packing stuff, you know, just to make sure the toys make it to you in one piece, you know, so that's a good thing. All right, there's probably between five and seven things inside of here, and probably a few smaller, maybe a couple bigger, we'll see. Now the box itself, I will say, I'm a little scared, because listen, that sounds like a lot of really small, probably like a, a higher quantity, more like six or seven small things. I don't know if there's any like anything big like action figures or video games I hope there's at least one video game I've really been kind of wanting to play like a classic game last night I was looking at my PS Vita online they have like online games you can download of like older games and I would really love to play some like classic games from like PS1 or Dreamcast or something like that so hopefully there's something like that in here but hey we're gonna find out right now all right let's go ahead and pull out the first thing here oh there's more packing let me try and oh there's things wrapped in packing this is interesting um, all right here let me pull out something I'm gonna try and grab something small to start uh, feels like wow they're all pretty big things uh, or at least like medium sized thing I'm just gonna grab one here at random let's see oh and it's a Pokemon how appropriate it's a ghastly figure this is really good for this month because if you're playing Pokemon Go you probably realize they just started the Halloween celebration and you get like extra candies and there's extra ghost type Pokemon and you know I don't have this in fact I don't think I've ever seen this it does say on the bottom here uh, Pokemon Looks like this is official licensed product, um, so that's good, and it's in really good condition. So really cool. I'm loving the translucent purple behind them here, and the, the little face looking really good. Nice paint job on it. No chips or bite marks or anything weird. So really cool start here, guys. This is a really nice one. And if you are playing Pokemon Go, I recommend taking advantage of this time. It's great that Pokemon Go are having you know a special time where you get extra candies and extra Pokemon and everything. And I'm sure it's kind of in relation to help like keep the subscriber base they have going, you know, because there isn't really new Pokemon like Gen 2 out yet. But this is fun, and I hope they do more things through the holidays like this, where during holidays they have special events. But anyway, for Halloween, very, very appropriate. So we'll put this down here and we'll go ahead and see what we have for our second thing. And I know I need to do a figure video. People have been wanting to see like my figure set and I'll probably do a recap video coming up sometime in like November or December. All right, the next thing here, let's see. Oh, cool, wow, so far we're getting some awesome Pokemon. Check this out. This looks like a very nice quality one too. I have to hand it to him this time around. Um, really cool things I don't have. I don't have this at all. So let's see here. Let's see if this is official. Uh, it says copyright Pokemon. So I think it's official. I mean, if it's not, it's a very nice paint job. This is, I don't have this. If you know where this came from, like, did this come from like a card set or a box? I mean, check out the, like the multi-coloring painting, the pink tongue, the eyes, really nice sculpt, the little uh, white claws, good base to it really cool tail feathers that is a really nice looking figure um i'm really impressed i've i've never seen this before in real life so um very cool i've probably seen it in a book or something but um so until you see it in real life sometimes it's hard to gauge the size and everything else but very cool um we're off to a great start let's see what we have for item number three more pokemon that is cool okay Check this one out here. All right, a little another PVC. These guys must have been watching my videos or something, man. 
Uh, this is great. And they actually are giving me things. I don't have this either. Uh, looking at the bottom here, it does say, it says copyright Pokemon. You know, I'm sorry it doesn't say like Tommy or something, but it's such a good sculpt, man. That's a really unique looking PVC Pokemon. Like, check out the white and the claws and the little red. Very nice paint job. Little pink in the mouth there. Even the eyes are painted. That is a really nice looking sculpt, man. I like the shading and the, the white is kind of a, a brown to it. Can make it kind of smoky looking and red and gray stripes. That is a really excellent looking figure. I'm so happy to have this. My God, you guys are doing great if you're watching this. I'm really blown away so far. We got three awesome Pokemons here. We'll push this guy down here. He doesn't want to stand so well, but that's okay. And um, very impressive. All right, let's see what's next. All right, this feels, maybe I'll save that one. I'm trying to grab the smallest stuff first if I can. Uh, let's see, I'll grab this one next. Oh, another cool Pokemon. Where did they get these amazing Pokemon? Oh my God. If these are like counterfeits, they're really beautiful counterfeits. Um, let's see, this one here at the bottom, it does say uh, copyright Pokemon with a really nice uh, blue translucent plastic base. And check out the paint job, it's really pretty. I mean, like little touches, like the slightly light translucent tips of the wings here. Really nice, like airbrushed little belly. The eyes painted. Nice white face. I mean, this looks really nice. This doesn't look like it's something which has been, you know, uh, through the vacuum cleaner or something. Um, really nice looking sculpt, man. Are you catching this? This is awesome. Um, this is definitely a heavy Pokemon box, but I'm digging it. That's awesome. We'll put him down there. All right, so four Pokemon so far. Now again, there's usually five to seven items. I think this is uh, closer to seven for sure, because I think there's a few, definitely a few things left in here. Let's see what's next. Uh, let's see here. I feel something like squishy. I'm trying to grab the smaller ones if I can. All right, let's see what this is. Oh, wow. I don't have this one either. Oh my God. They have went Pokemon crazy this month. I'm digging it. All right, this one here is a little bit more used looking. There's a few little scrapes and scratches, but you know, that's okay. Um, down here, it says 2011 Pokemon Company Nintendo. So I'd say this is officially licensed product, which is cool. There's some articulation here to the legs. It looks like they, they can move a little bit slightly. You can see there's a leg that moves. Okay, um, little holes. This is probably part of some kind of like play set, um, like action play set. The eyes could probably use a little touch up paint around the, the top part here, but it's still pretty cool, man. I don't have this and this is great to add this to my, my Pokemon collection. If you know what this is from, let me know. It's really cool. Okay, we'll pop this one down maybe back here. Oh, he wants to lean. That's okay, we'll let him lean. All right, next thing. I think there's a couple items left here at least. Feels like uh, probably like three items. So we're doing really good, man, because we already got five. We're gonna have eight items this time. All right, next thing. I don't know if this is the biggest or smallest. I'm just grabbing one. Oh, it's a Pikachu thing. Wow, and this looks brand new. It looks like maybe they're going for like more new items or something. Um, with the exception of the, the alligator guy, um, these seem like they're, they're brand new. And this is, oh my gosh, look at this. It's a super cute little Pikachu keychain thing. Let's see here. Oh, it's a hip hop parade. Okay, so maybe it's not official Pokemon. This is like, it looks like Pikachu though, obviously. Um, and it's like, is it his? Oh, it's just kind of his butt. That, that's kind of funny. Oh my God. All right, there's no face to Pokemon here. This is just like his little tail end. So I guess he could like stick this in your pocket and it looks like he's like diving head first into your pocket or something. I don't know. That's really cute. Um, I've never seen this before. It does say copyright Pokemon made in China, so I don't know. I would have to think this is, like, not <laughs> legit. I don't know. Um, if you've seen this before, I mean, being that it says hip, hip Hop Parade makes me feel like it's not, like, real. But then what's weird, check it, guys. It does have Pikachu there, or a Pikachu-like thing. But it does say Pokemon there. So yeah, that could either be, like, a fake Chinese, like, uh like trademark or something or I don't know but it's brand new and it is Pikachu's back end so um very fine I guess it could be a phone thing too it's got the little phone tether as you can see and then it has like a little keychain uh thing too so really cute um not quite sure how I use that but um I do not have a Pokemon Derriere uh plushie so I guess now I can say I do so that's pretty cool all right let's see what's next here, we'll push this stuff back a little bit so we can admire all the goodness. Here, we'll put this back here. So, all right, let's see what's next. We got a couple things left. All right, two things left. All right, let's see. We got this here, and this is a Pokemon. Oh, you know, I may have this one. 
it's okay if I do. Uh, let's see. Or maybe I just have like a different pose, but the same one. Let's see. Looking really cool. Saluting Team Rocket. Um, real cool. Uh, paint job looks good. Looks like it's in good condition. I'd say this is a used one. Um, I do not see a Pokemon. Well, wait, what's up there? Um, now nah, it looks like it's legit, actually, from the, the seal there. Um, this is probably from some kind of like play plug and play set or something. Um, that's interesting. I didn't realize I had that on the tail. Uh, but maybe I just never really noticed. I don't know. But really cute. Love the expression. Love the mouth open. Love the salute. Very cool. All right. We'll go ahead and pop that down there. And we got one thing left. And the thing doesn't feel the biggest in the world. I'm thinking it's an action figure. It feels like it has human legs. Maybe it's Ash. I don't really think I have an Ash figure. Let's see. This has been very, very Pokemon related, though. Maybe it's going to be a McFarlane toy, though, too. They do that quite a bit here. And let's see. Oh, it is something crazy. I would say this is a McFarlane toy. Yep, yeah, McFarlane. And this is some kind of crazy zombie thing. Look at this. Oh, it feels gross. It's like rubbery. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. So this is this is cool and different. Um, it's like a zombie or like a walker kind of thing. And it's made out of clear plastic. So you can kind of see like the, the spinal cord and everything in through. Um, I almost wonder if this is like the X-Files. What's to say on the bottom here? Um, McFarlane Toys made in China. Copyright 1998 Fox. You know what? This could be an X-Files thing. Let me know, guys. Okay. There was a thing in the X-Files where like humans will get like infected by aliens and they turn like gelatinous like this and then they burst into water or something and they have like a, a baby alien inside. And that's what could be what that gray thing is there if you see that strange looking gray thing inside of him. Um, this this could be that. I kind of think 1998 sounds about right. This probably might have come with a like a X-Files like stretcher or something. I'm not sure. Um, I know Visigoth has done some X-Files videos, so I might have to look back on her collection or videos and um, see. But um, I'm thinking this is either like Walking Dead, but I really think this is X-Files if it's Fox, you know. But I love the little veins. Check out the cool little veins going through the clear plastic. And I love the way you can see the organs and stuff. Um, very, very cool. So um, anyway, your toy box, I want to thank you very much for all this cool stuff. I don't think he's going to stand. No, zombies. Whoa, he almost did. Oh, no, not quite. Zombies don't stand. I'll lay him here. Um, out of all these things, I really love the whole box. It was a great deal. If you're interested in this kind of thing, it's $25, okay? And as you can see, for $25, bucks, you know, shipped, priority mail. Priority mail shipping probably is like 5 bucks or whatever. So it's like 20 bucks worth of stuff. And I'd say I got 20 bucks worth out of it this time around for sure. I'm really digging these Pokemon figures. Um, I want to say this is really beautiful. And I don't, still don't know if it's completely legit, but it looks like absolutely beautiful. I'm loving it. This, I don't have anything like this at all. This is a really cool pose, and this looks like this could have been from like a box set or something. But um, again, just says Pokemon, which is a little weird. And then this one here, just beautiful sculpt, man. This is so pretty. Really, really nice Pokemon. Um, but again, it just says Pokemon, which is a little odd. So anyway, guys, I want to thank you very much for watching this video. Let me know what you think. Do you think this is like, uh, like what is the coolest thing in your, your mind out of all this stuff? Do you have a favorite? And... Um, Anyway, I want to thank you for watching this video. Be sure and enter the 5,000 subscriber giveaway because we'll be giving away a Pokemon 20 and some other really cool stuff. You can watch that video for all the details. Be sure and check out Tux Reviews, my review channel. I have lots of cool content popping up on there too. Be sure and check out Tux Toys on Instagram and Twitter. Tux Reviews on a separate Instagram and Twitter. And also be sure and check out Gamer Tux, my beta channel. And again, guys, I really appreciate you watching these videos. I read your comments and um, I just want to thank you. So um, thank Thanks for being part of this, all right? All right, talk to you soon, friends. Bye-bye.